Are all of the terrible reviews of American Airlines true? I don't know. We're about to find out. So we just typed into Google American Airlines and literally everything that came up was negative. Yeah, we looked on Yelp and TripAdvisor. We fly American Airlines all the time. It makes you think you're that special. And so we were just curious, you know, what do people, you people, think? <laughs> what do you mean, you people? Of American Airlines. You work hard for your money. You work hard for the money. But you want it to go towards something that you feel like you're getting a good value. Yeah, with everything going up in America, prices of flights just seem to be skyrocketing. This house is a prison on planet bullshit. Hundreds of dollars for like the shortest flights across the country. So we took a compilation of reviews. From Yelp or TripAdvisor, and so we're gonna look at all the reviews for different areas. All right, guys, so we're either gonna prove them wrong or prove them right. We'll see. Let's go. Let's go. Susie S. says, worst travel experience of my life, other than the time I was in an airplane crash. Bad news is, we're crash landing. Well, it sounds like Susie had some low standards coming in, too. One star. One star. Forrest B. One star review. <laughs> Have you ever dookied your pants? That's what the entire experience with American Airlines is like. They had never admit responsibility and always blame the weather. I'd rather hitchhike a freight train than fly with them again. <laughs> So you're telling me there's a chance. And we also were delayed on the way here due to weather. weather. <laughs> yes. All right. Trajaz B. S airline won't even give proper Wi-Fi. Like, bro, I've got priorities. I've got to text the Hannah, ho. SMH, don't fly on here. And dude in front of me was farting nonstop. He's a public hazard. Come on, do better. All right, this is Dale B's one star review. If I could give American Airlines less than one star, I would. If you like having troubles checking in, paying for your bags, sitting in dirty planes and sticky carpeting and food crumbs all over your seat, a broken seat, then American Airlines is for you. Horrible, worst experience. Attendant spilled coffee on me during turbulence causing burns and didn't apologize or rectify the situation. I mean, a little apology goes a long way. All right, Dave S is one star review. Once again, screwed by American Airlines. Their customer service is garbage. I hate this airline. And your food sucks too. I went both directions across the country and had the same lousy dish both ways. Are you that pitiful that you can't mix up meals a little? Never again. Well, we did pay for a first class ticket on three of the flights and we were only giving snacks on a two and a half hour flight, which I feel like compared to our Oh, Qatar. Qatar. Airways. We yeah. were given a full meal and it was a two hour flight. No, it was 45 minutes. 45 minutes oh from Abu Dhabi gosh. to Doha. Yeah, yeah, 45 minutes and it yeah. was like a full spread. American. So that's uh, a definite Comparison, negative yeah. for sure. However, oh on the first flight, the stewards were uh, slightly cold, but it was early in the morning. So we'll give them that. Second yeah. flight, Great staff. Yeah, it think? was It was mainly, yeah, there was a guy on there that was hilarious. Even yeah. if the hard product isn't the best, if they have a great staff, you kind of forget about it. Somewhat, kinda. Sweet lord, their bathrooms are disgusting and not the odd paper on the floor type of disgusting. We are talking vents covered in dirt and grime, the toilet and poop stuck on the edges, the sink was full of schmutz. <laughs> the door handle had grease on it. How dare they charge me these types of prices and can't be bothered to clean their lavatories. Yeah. Horrible. I mean, don't come to my house. I'm just kidding. No. He would never allow that. Never. Get back in the kitchen. <laughs> uh. So there's a big difference, I think, in the first class versus the people in the back. <clears throat> Awkward but ours was fine. The one in the back, another lady did say, don't sit in the back, it smells like piss. And those could definitely use a few more cleanings. Ours was not terrible though. Yeah. <laughs> so I was shocked actually, that amount of leg room that you have in first class compared to a normal economy seat. It was super narrow. We're about to fly economy on this next leg. 
And so I'll, I'll get a clip of that and I'll, uh, I'll show you what that one's like, but I'm pretty sure it's not much different. I had to, pretty sure the first class was actually less legroom, shockingly, than economy. All right, Jess K said in her one star review, somehow worse than spirit. <laughs> this flight hasn't even taken off yet and I'd already rather be on a spirit flight. Ooh, that's not good. Oh boy. We managed to stumble across one five star review. <laughs> from Cecile S. Eddie is the best. He must be a flight attendant. After discovering the plane, tire was flat. The flight was delayed for two and a half hours in Tucson. Well, there's that. Yeah. Uh, our connections were blown and there just wasn't enough people to help with all the new. And then Tay forgot to put in the rest of the review on here, so I can't read I it. Cut it off. Way to go, man. Yeah. But. but positive. I bet you that that Eddie guy was the flight attendant that we <laughs> had too. So there's yeah. one good one. You got to get Eddie. All right. So our overall opinion on American Airlines, it is one of the big three in the U.S. And I think that they're a bit underrated. Every time that I've flown American Airlines, I've always had a pretty positive experience. Uh, the service has always been pretty decent. Now they are lacking in a bit with seats, the hard product and you know, the food sometimes, but overall I think it's a pretty decent airline and I, I don't mind flying them. You can. Okay, I'll be honest. So interesting, the flights that we've taken today have been really good, but in the past we have had some terrible stewardesses. Yikes. We've had terrible gate agents that are just so rude. They seem like they hate their job. Uh, but this experience today kind of proved all that wrong. All right, so what, what do we give it on a scale of one to five, just like all the reviews that we've read? I'm gonna give it a three out of five. I think it was pretty That's decent. I was, gonna do. Oh. I was gonna do three out of five too. Yeah, so American Airlines, not so bad. <laughs> all right, well, if you guys like this sort of thing, uh, leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Thanks See you guys. For watching.